Do you remember in the previous lesson, we looked at how we can quickly multiply any two-digit number by 11? If you didn't, here's an example to remind you. Can you multiply 26 by 11 in under 5 seconds? Go! Okay, your time is up. You should have gotten an answer of 286. Yeah, that's where you found the calculator. 26 times 11 is indeed 286. And for those of you who missed that video, you can check it out in the playlist. However, as a quick refresher, all we simply needed to do was take the first digit, which is 2, record it. Add the first digit to the second digit, so that's 2 plus 6 equals 8. Place that down and then simply record the last digit, 286. In this lesson, we're going to look at how we can multiply even larger numbers by 11. Take this number for instance. So, I'm going to give you 10 seconds to get the answer to this question. Your time starts now. Go. Okay. If you were trying to apply the same trick that you learned previously, you would have found some difficulty. It doesn't work. However, there is a just as easy trick to work out the answer to questions like these in just a few seconds and I'm going to show you that now in this video. So the answer to this question, follow me, would be 235,785. Okay, let's verify on the calculator. 21,435 times 11 is indeed 235,785. So let's see how you can do this without a calculator mentally in just a few seconds the way I did. It's quite simple. So what you do is, as before, you record the first number, first number is 2, and then you simply add the first number to the second number, That's step 2, that gives us 3, add the second number, you see where this is going, to the third number, that's step 3, gives us 5, add the third number to the fourth number, that's step 4, that gives us 7, and then we add the fourth number to the fifth number, that gives us eight. And then once again, we simply record the last number, which is five. Now, how easy was that? And we get an answer of 235,785. Okay, now I'm going to give you a question to work out on your own, applying the technique that you just learned. Have a go at this. Okay, I'm going to give you another 10 seconds, go. Alright, you should have gotten an answer of... One hundred and forty-seven thousand seven hundred and fifty-two. Again, let's verify on our calculator. So we have thirteen thousand four hundred and thirty-two times eleven, and indeed it is one hundred and forty-seven thousand seven hundred and fifty-two. Now go impress your friends, your family, and strangers 
by showing them how you can calculate numbers with sums of hundreds of thousands in your head in just a few seconds. That's it for this video in the series. See you again in the next one. Bye for now.